Welcome back, Benny Vapes here, not with a review, we're on a little bit of a vlog train, we are, we're on that chinwag show, so yeah, that's what we're doing, we're having a little bit of a chinwag, I used to do these semi-regular when I first started, but I ain't done one for a while, to be honest with you, no, so I just thought it was about time that I did one, it's end of the year, so we'll wrap up the year, you know, I've had a few things go on this year, um, which I'll talk about, um, and I just thought we'd wrap up the year um, here and now with this little vlog so we'll start off with the beginning of the year the beginning it's, it's been a shite year hasn't it really do you know what I mean? we're still in this fucking covid mess up thing you know it keeps coming going and changing into different variants um and now we're on uh, transformers series <laughs> fuck knows um so yeah that's what's been going on this year um throughout the year but you know this channel has had um a few little bits going on you know um i've had my two-year anniversary which was i think it was october november time two years um something like that you know two of my shows have had um birthdays you know we've had the nuvs has done a hundred shows um Mixing with Benny and Friends and UK E-Liquid Mixing Show. They're knocking up same. Um, I think they're nearly up to 100 shows now um, between them. You know, so yeah, so I've had a few little milestones, which has been good. Um, the biggest one's got to be reaching 1,000 subscribers. Um, I held off. To, if you wonder why I never did bells and whistles, jumping up and down, flashing all over social media, it's because I held off a little bit because uh, YouTube can be a little bit of a bastard. When they see you getting up to that, sort of um playing you know of the thousand subscribers i can text them off for you and you get jumped about and people leave and the tech piss um but unless 44 people or 45 which would take me on for a thousand leave straight away after this vlog then i can comfortably say that i'm over a thousand subscribers um and that means the world to me it really really does mean the world to me um i think that's a very big achievement for myself a very big achievement for the channel. You can say what you want. People on, you know, the 300, 400, 500 subscribers in America, you know, the bigger ones over here that are on, you know, your 70s, your 20s, your 10s. Say what you want. Say what you want. Right at this moment, I think that is a fantastic achievement to reach a 1,000 because it is sort of tailed off a little bit. You know, the, there's not as many um, people seem to be watching things. Um, everybody's saying that the shows, you can tell on the shows and things like that. Even in America, are saying the same thing. I watch um, Not Another Vape Show, and they're always going on about there's not as many in the chat. You know, they're probably... And they've got some big stars on there. They've got, you know, Mike Vapes and, you know, Vaping Fagan. And they're on, you know, 200,000 subscribers and they're getting in chat maybe about 250 300 people go figure you know so yeah so it is hard to get that thousand it is hard to get that thousand subscribers and i'm one of the new people on the block you could call us new people i've been here two years <laughs> it's like that neighbor down your road that you've never talked to for the last 10 years oh that new lad that new family down road they've been there 10 years <laughs> do you know what i mean it's a bit like that but i am I, we are a new breed of um reviewers that have come through there's a few of us that started up over the two-year period um that have come in you know so there's quite a few new reviewers that came on the scene and then you just check it up a little bit you know and there's loads of shows going on and things like that you know but i'm the first one out of them as far as i know i'm the first one out of all of them that's got over a thousand subscribers you know so i i think that's really really good i'm really proud to be the first one to get over a thousand subscribers um 
I did get a little bit of help on the way. I won't say I didn't. Um, I did get, you know, being on one of the biggest shows in the UK, um, which was the UK Vape Show uh, with Vic. Um, I went on there, you know, so that boosted me up a little bit. For whatever you say, it didn't give me a massive um, subscriber base, but it got me a kick up. It just got me noticed. Um, I went on um, Three Men in a Vape Show with Aiden when I first started, and that gave me a boost. You know, so people have sort of helped me along the way. But most of it I've done myself, you know, by coming up with shows and, you know, putting out regular reviews and things like that. So, yeah, so have had a little bit of help um, with the bigger shows, but not a great deal. Like I say, it, I didn't get massive. What everybody says, I didn't get masses of subscribers. I got a few, um, uh, but the, it was more to put my face out there because that's the hardest thing when you first start is to get your face out, get people noticing, and get people knowing about you on the uh, vape scene. You know, of course, my big Benny Love hands, <laughs> Benny Vapes hands is out there now, a lot of people say Benny Vapes hands, because I can't do arts, <laughs> I can't do, it comes out, I don't fucking, yeah, I can't do it. So, yeah, so people do that when they're doing Benny Vapes hands. So, yeah, it gets you out there, it gets you noticed, it gets you out into that little world of YouTube and gives you a few subscribers. You know, I'm not expecting to get, you know, 10,000. I'm not even expecting to get much higher than what I am now, to be honest with you. I might get up to, you know, tops 1,500, I think. But I probably won't get 2,000. Um, it'll be sort of, you know, where it's going, you know, sort of how YouTube is. I might get it in, you know, another five years. I might hit 2,000. But I'm just so pleased that I have hit 1,000. Um, I never thought I'd get 1,000 when I first started, to be honest with you. I didn't. Um, I thought it'd be, you know, maybe 10 people who want to watch me. When you first start, you always think, oh, fuck it, I can do this. I can do this. It's absolutely brilliant. You know, I'm going to get loads. I'm going to be fucking YouTube famous. Talking to a camera when you're looking at it with no one about and feeling a knob is the worst fucking feeling in the world. Especially when you're a bit of social anxiety like I have. You know, it's really, really hard to talk into a camera and, you know, look at the camera, look at the camera. Aidan would always say that. What are you looking at fucking screen for? Look at the camera. You know, so it took me, it took me nearly two years to look at the camera without looking at my face on the screen. <laughs> do you know what I mean? So, yeah, it, it is hard to do. And if anybody tells you any different, you know, then they're lying, because it is. You know, it's hard doing a live show. Um, I still get nervous. You'll see me. I play with. If you, you could see down here, I, I play with my hands all the time um, because I get nervous, and it's just natural to get nervous. You know, actors, big actors do it. You know, and things like that. So yeah. Um, but I hope as the two years have gone on that you have seen my personality come out. You've seen my, you know, things change. I, you know, the, the channels change. Um, I've had new logos, I've done a computer, I've made things a little bit better, I've changed things. I'm going to change things up um, next year as well, you know, going forward. The channel's going to be changed. I'm going to try something different, I'm going to try little bits and pieces. Um, so the mixture of going back to the original stuff without a load of um, montage that I, that I do with speeding up, but I'm going to still do the montage, but I'm going to sort of do a little bit different in it. Um, I'm also going to be, you know, obviously changing up my live shows a little bit, um, you know, and trying to get them a bit more streaming, a little bit better, you know, and a little bit more content, a little bit more free-flowing rather than, you know, sort of me just babbling on, because sometimes I think that I take over everything. Um, it's because I get nervous and I, I just need to talk. <laughs> if I don't talk, I'm like, <laughs> what am I not doing? Um, other thing is having gaps in your show. It, it's really, really hard. If everybody stops talking, then it, it's the worst thing in the world. You, you know, it's like dead air. There's no worse than dead air. You know, so I'm going to try and get it more free flowing. Get a little bit more. Um, banter going on and things like that do you know what i mean where we just have a little bit of chat with your mates um and see where we go mixing show is always going to be a mixing show because i get on them it'll be more than uvs that needs to change slightly in the new year um and we'll see where that goes but yeah so it's a thousand subscribers um it is the end of the year vlog of what's going forward next year which i've talked a little bit some pieces about you know and there's people over the year that i, I, I need to you know thank um there's me and uvs crew so we've got you know jp skin uh steve blazing um jay octon funk you know so they they've come on trek came on um just to help us out 
um, which is much appreciated. Um, you know, JP's been there. Um, I think we were about ten episodes in, maybe when J- James came on. Um, JP, you know, things have gone on, and I'll talk about that in a, in, a, in a little bit. But you know, so he came on, um, and then you know, I've had you know Ian above the clouds, which started it off with me. Um, I think he came on the third show, and you, you can't not talk about Big D Vapes and the Bobster who started the first ever show off with me. Um, the Bobster's obviously not about that much. Um, Big D um, has opened two shops um, now and stepped back a little bit. He's still got his social media present. <laughs> present. You know, everybody knows Big D. You know, he's still doing um, titles for people's shows, his artworks out there and everything like this, you know. So he still gets a mention. He doesn't go anywhere. Um, you know, he's, he's quite a... Um, YouTube celebrity without being on YouTube, to be fair. <laughs> he's, uh, he's Danny. You know, we've had vaping with CJ. Um, he comes on, still comes on, you know, um, on and off. He came on for a little while. You know, they've both gone off and done their own shows. Um, a lot of people come on NU- NUVS and then drift off and do their own shows, um, which is fine, which is fine. They still come back, you know when I ask them to, if they're free, you know, which is all good. That's what you get for having friends um, that we can jump on the show. I have had um, other people on the show um, which came on as casters, but, you know, obviously they've left and moved on, whatever. Um, we've had Skin, who's just totally gone, totally gone out the window. <laughs> he's, he's left, he's more doing his little vloggy things or his TikTok videos. He's TikTok famous. Go over to TikTok. He's got loads of subscribers on TikTok, so he's found his way on there. Um, and he's just had a little baby, and, you know, he's stepped back from the vaping, um, and he does, like, his little walkabout vlogs and his kids and things like that. He's just gone totally, he's dropped out of vaping totally. We've also had um, Kyle Vapan, which he, he obviously he stepped back a little bit, but he came on for a little while. We had McTavish that stopped, stepped in, James that stepped in to um, help us out. When Bargain Vapes closed down, he stepped in as a caster, and then obviously he's gone back, he's gone on the Nature Vape. Um, and then we've had, you know, Mr. Jackson, Mr. Jackson, Mark Jackson, yes. We had him on as a caster, um, but obviously work commitments and things like that. Um, but you can catch him on Nature Vape and on uh, the bullshit show on a Saturday with uh, Sloan, Cloud Cartel. You know, so yeah, so you can catch them. But they did come on um, as casters, but obviously they've moved on and things like that. You know, So yeah, so that's NUVS. So thank you very much to everybody that's come on as a caster, everybody else that helps us out, and everybody that's been on as a guest on NUVS. It's been absolutely fantastic to meet some great people. It's been absolutely fantastic to um, have a show that's got a hundred shows. Con- you know, so that means we've constantly known enough being on every week over the last two years, you know, to get a hundred shows, um, which is, which is brilliant. So thank you very much for everybody who has helped us out on NUVS. And so that, that'll move me on to, um, the mixing show. Um, so the mixing show, I came up with an idea after I'd done NUVS. I noticed that there's not many UK send. We'll call it UK mixing shows. There were a couple of people doing mixing shows. There still is a couple of people doing mixing shows. Um, but there was never a group of people doing mixing shows. So I put it to Bill, see if he'd come on with me for the first one, which he did, um, which we're mixing with Benny and friends. Um, and, you know, we started doing that. And then... Halfway through that, we decided to drop that because of people were doing shows and we thought we'll we'll take the UK e-liquid mixing show title over. And that's what it is now. Um, so we got Bill, then we got Bobo, then we got Graham, then we got Liam. You know, so yeah, so we've got Bill, myself, Graham, Liam and Bobo. Bobo's stepped down a little bit because he's busy on a Wednesday. If you want to go see a naked poet, doing some rhymes <laughs> then if you're in Liverpool go over and see him at, you know whatever I think it's Crossley go over and see him he'll be there um, he's doing an open mic that means anybody can get up that's why I'm saying might find a naked poet on there because anybody can get up and, and do stuff on an open mic but he's running an open mic now on a Wednesday which it used to be I think it would either Tuesday or Thursday um, which means he could do mixing show so he, he's doing that so he has stepped back a little bit still part of us Still part of the mixing 
show, but he has stepped back. So that just leaves me, um, Liam, Graham, Bill. Um, and there's also another one that comes on, which um, which is Tim, Advocate for Living. So he comes on and off with us. Um, so we've also had um, Nick Nevins that comes on semi-regular on the mixing show. Um, and he's one of the best UK e-liquid mixers um, for DIY. Um, and it's great to have someone with his knowledge come on and help us out. And if it's in quite well with us, he's got a dry sense of humour. Um, you know, so yeah, he, he does play along with us. We do rib him um, and he ribs us back. Um, he's in chats and all that lot. Um, yeah, he has got a bit of a dry sense of humour. Um, but we get on really well with him, all those lads and he's embraces us and he comes on and he helps us out when he can. Um, and he comes on quite regular. So yeah, um, so thank you very much, Nick, for coming on with us because it does mean a lot when you've got a really big um, experienced mixer helping you out. Um, so yeah, so yeah, so we do have a few people. We've had some great guests on there, absolutely fantastic guests on the UK Elite Mixing Show. The mixing community has took us in um, and embraced us. So we had some, we've had some of the top mixers from America on. Um, we've had some mixers from Australia. We've had Pippa on, um, Wolf Tan. Um, we've had we've had people from all over, absolutely all over. You know that have helped us out. Um, Addy Tooney, I never even thought we'd get him on. You know what I mean? We've had loads of people on. We've had Scuba on. You know we've had we've had people on the UK Liquid Mixing Show that I would never ever thought I'd get on the show, which is absolutely brilliant and just embraced us. You know, so I would like to thank you know Zippy for being on, coming on with us and being in chat. Um, the OGA crew. You know, so go over and check them out. They've embraced us, you know, so they're like, you know, a twit of us um, that they do their show on a Saturday and they've just embraced us, you know. Um, so we've had a few people on. So, yeah, there's been people in chat. It's been absolutely brilliant, absolutely brilliant that we've had, you know, people in chat. And that's got its own little crowd because it's a different show. It's not it's not just about vaping, it's about mixing. And it's a different crowd. Va mixing and vaping are two different things. You know, it's a different set of people that uh, watch mixing shows and we get we get views afterwards i get views on them i get views on it afterwards so it's all good um yeah and i hope we have helped some people out um by bringing it to the uk and saying look this is how you mix e-liquid you know um and i hope people have um enjoyed doing it and took it on board because it is a place for new mixers they can come on you know and talk because we've got some of the best mixers in the uk um, to be fair, we've got Liam Sherlock Holmes and we've got Graham Net Reality. We've got Nick Evans that comes on and he's in chat. You know, so there's always people that you can t ask questions. So if you are new and you fancy doing it, just come in, come in, chat. Um, sit back, relax, and just enjoy the show and just ask whatever questions you want. And uh, but I do hope it's helped people out. I do, because um, I think it's you know it, it's what's needed, and you know it's it's not going anywhere. It's still going strength to strength, you know. So yeah, so that's me casters and me me two shows um, to say thank you to. I would like to thank um, a few companies that I've worked with throughout the year. Um, there's a few, not many, not many. Because if you think that I get free shit all the time, I don't. Um, I get little bits and pieces. Um, I get teased and then dropped, teased and dropped, <laughs> basically. So, yeah. Um, so, company that, Mark Nature Vape, what a fantastic guy he is. Um, like I say, he's got two of my other course on, who used to course, the NUVS, he's got Jackson on there, and he's also got um, James McTavish on there, McTavish on there, um, on his Tuesday show. But what a great guy is, you know, people can say whatever, he is a great guy. He supported the smaller company, he sent me bits and pieces out, you know, over my two years. Um, so, Mark, thank you very much, my friend. Um, it does mean the world that you've actually um, take time to support us. Um, so, yeah, go check him out um, and check out the shows. But, yeah, Mark Nature Vape, great guy, absolute great guy. What everybody says, you know, he is, I think, is fantastic. Also, 888 Vapor sent me a little bit of juice out, you know, so I'm going to open them. So, yeah, so thank you very much for that. I've also, Digby's is another one. Digby's is really, really good. Um, they didn't have to send me, they sent me a couple of bottles out for review, sent me a little tester one out, um, which I bobbed up and put it on <laughs> on Instagram. <laughs> and I wasn't supposed to, but yeah, he had a bit of a laugh about it. Um, but yeah, go over and check out Digby's. They do have some good sales on, um, but they're a great guy at Digby's. Um, and a great company to actually um, work with. I've also, Rochford Project, 
Um, Jay, what a fantastic guy Jay is um, going on with Eliquid. He sent me some, he said, he sent me one of my favourite juices out of the year. Um, recommend it if you're a straw lover, which is um, Crimson Seed. Good, just go out and buy it if you're, if you're a straw lover. Just go out and buy it. It is one of the best strawberry um, tarts I've ever tasted in my life um, on Eliquid. Um, it beats some real ones, to be fair. Uh, <laughs> do you know what I mean? So, Jay at Rochford Project, thank you very much, my friend. Um, it does mean a lot that you sent me bits and pieces out um, for review. So thank you, much appreciated. And go to, like I say, all these companies, go check them out. Um, see what you think. Go watch my videos. There's sometimes a little bit of a ticker at the bottom. All I've mentioned where you can find them. Just use Google Foo. Um, also, Drip Drop sent me a load of um, flavours out, little 10 mils of their 10 mil range. Um, they had a little, they've been around the years. They've been around the years. They've struggled with COVID and that lot. So do go out and check them out. You can get some 10 mil bottles that are over there um, for like £2 for a 10 mil bottle. Um, UK made, um, you can get now, I think it's uh, 30 mils you can get and you can get on 120s, you get 60 mils. Go over and check them out. Go on and check them out. They are a UK company. Um, and they, they need some love. They need some support. Um, all these companies are going to go. Um, so go over, drip drop. Just look for it, drip drop vapor. They've got loads of flavors. Some of them might not be to your tasting. You know, some of them are all right. Some of them might not be the the half decent. But give them, a, they're worth a try, aren't they? You know what I mean? Um, Cotton Cable sent me out the full range of their e liquids. Um, I've only done half of them because there's that many. <laughs> I've got to get my tail out. I've got the two, the last bit of their range um, to do, which will be coming out after. Um, new year um but thank you very much cotton Kev charlie for sending my full range out to me i know it's been a little bit i think everybody was saying because we're a bit shot everybody i've noticed that we're doing reviews suddenly got the full range of them and they're like shit this is a lot of e liquid to go through so i will be wrapping up with the um 10 <laughs> that, are, that are the last ones to do you know so that'll be done in the new year but thank you very much cotton cable for sending them out for review much appreciated um totally wicked got in touch with me um obvious stuff uh, vape pens that they sent out but it meant a lot for them uh so actually actually totally wicked to get in touch with me i was really chuffed to be honest with you um i know they got in touch with a few other reviewers to send their disposable out to get them out there but they sent me some t-shirts and a little bit of a goodie pack you know so it's all good it's all good you know so thank you very much to them um vaporesso I've been quite a big supporter of this channel from when it you know from when it first started. You know, they sponsored NUVS, you know, for a little bit. Um, sent us loads of stuff out. They've tailed off now. Um, they had a change of management and everything, so I don't hear nothing from them now. Um, that's why you'll notice that there's not um, any Vaporesso stuff being sent through and it won't just me it won't just me there's quite a lot of reviewers that have not got vaporesso stuff sent through to them um which is a bit of a kicking and nadas because i did do quite a lot of videos for them um uh you know i did everything they asked for and then they just drop you like a stone which is a bit shit to be to be fair when you've worked with them but it is what it is maybe they'll get back in touch maybe they'll send some stuff out um the people who own vaporesso get in touch with me Smalls group, they, they've got in touch with me to do some reviewing, but uh, Vaporesso have dropped me like a fucking stone for some reason. But hey, anyway, like I say, it's not just me. There's other reviewers that have been dropped um, and some reviewers that they've kept on. So it is what it is. We'll see how it goes next year. They may get back in touch, they may not. Smock. Smock have got back in touch with me, I will tell you that. Um, but I did do for some, did some reviewing for Smock products um, and then COVID fucking it and fucked it all up, to be honest with you. Because, uh, and then America decided that they wasn't going to um, send um, vape things through. So Smock just fucking stopped every fucker instead of, you know, just sending it out thing so bigger reviewers have got the smock stuff through um but the smaller reviewers have been a bit dropped because you, you've got to pay for postage and things like that you know so it's not free i have to pay for postage on it but it's still cheaper than buying a um going out and buying a product um you know so i just pay a bit of postage um and get it through but it does stop that because they couldn't send postage through to us but they have got back in touch with me so hopefully things will progress in the new year and we'll see where we go um i'm a, you know it's probably going to be some disposables because that's how, how everybody seems to be doing but i'm happy to do for smock some disposable if you send it through there's a few companies that i'll do things for and a few companies you know that i'm not going to bother with but yeah 
so that's that so that's spot so thank you very much uh we also have um i can't miss this out um graham net reality with um amatorium he set up his own e-liquid company this year um and sent some bottles through for review you know so yeah do go and show him some love he's give away stuff he's on my mixing show um he's got a discount code going um benny Tain. you have to hurry up with that as well um for discount codes on Amatorium because I think he's changing things, he's changing things up. So discount code will probably only work up till maybe end of January. I don't know what his plans is, but just go try it. It's Benny Ten for ten percent, ten percent off uh, Amatorium e liquids. Um, but go show him some love. He's got some crackers. You know what I mean? If you like mean Kendall Bink it's absolutely brilliant. You know, so go check that out. Um, I like the lemon pocket. I think that's one of his better ones. Um, is lemon pocket um, but i know country fudge is going down well um and so is the um glamour people seem to be liking glamour so go check him out um and like i say um go show him some love because he does give stuff back to you by coming on shows and giving his mixing tips you know so go buy his e-liquids also oh, oh sure also um nick evans uh, ancient alexa um he did send his full range out and to be fair i've got to love it really one of them which is blue. <laughs> I love it and hate it. It's fucking strange. One minute I love it, one minute I hate it. You know, it is, it is, it's nice. And then I'm like, why the fuck am I vaping? Because I don't like it. So, yeah, um, go check out that. I've got his last one to do, which is trifle, um, which sort of things coming up to Christmas went a bit pear-shaped. We're doing reviews. I didn't have a lot of time because I had to do shopping and things like that. But I have got his trifle left to do. Um, so that'll be coming out in the new year. Um, but rest of them have been all right. Um, they've been half-decent flavours, you know, so they are worth going out and have a look. Um, they're gaining a bit of a momentum. Um, I know his sponsors... Um, Englishman and an Irishman, so go check him out. Go check him out um, and see what you think of if his e liquids. Like I say, blue. It blues really, really, <laughs> really nice. But I fucking hate it. Go figure. <laughs> so yeah. Um, also, um, we've got. I've got some liquids coming off. If you are in Barnsley area, um, I got four e liquids um, to try from a vape shop. I just walked in and were buying some stuff. Mentioned they were on it. Give me some, and that's. Uh, Vape, what's it called? It's a vape shop and bargains galore in Barnsley. Literally, his shop is fucking stacked with. So, if you are in Barnsley, go check them out because he's got hundreds and hundreds of e liquids. They're just all over the place. It's a little shop, but it's like a landing's fucking cave. Um, so, yeah, so I've got some e liquids for him. They're coming up in the new year. Um, so, do go check them out if you are in Barnsley. Well, you'll find it, put it in Google. Vape shop and bargains galore. Really good shop. So thank you very much for sending that through. Um, I will pop down and see you in the new year. Um, have a little bit of a chat. NUVS had originally, which I'm going to... I'm sort of a mixture of this because I want to mention people and I've got to mention him. Um, Danny Big D Vapes. Um, his shop sponsored us for a little bit. Um, so do go over to one first or Slough It, Slave Weight, whichever you want to call it, um, and check out Big D Vapes. Um, he was original sponsor for us. He got Vapor S on board for us. Um, so yeah, go check him out. Um, if you are in Slough It or you're in Homeforth, um, go check out um, Big D Vapes. Um, Homeforth is just opposite the co-op. Slough It is down on the main road. You can't really miss it. So go check them out. Um, but it's hard is that because I want to mention Danny and I don't want to because Danny comes in my friends. <laughs> so it's a bit of an hard one is that one. But he has been a sponsor. Um, and then we've had two other sponsors of two of my shows. Um, I've had um, Andy at Best Sig Liquid um, was fortunate enough for us to have when we first started to get us going a fantastic sponsor which was Andy at Best Sig Liquid um, for, the, for the mixing with Benny Friends and uh, UK Liquid Mixing Show. He did support us. He sent loads of gear out. He put okay, we're throwing things at us, which were absolutely brilliant. Um, you know, so thank you, Andy, for supporting the mixing show. It, that means the world to us, the sponsors. You know, so thank you very much. Um, it did mean a world to us for you to to sponsor us at the beginning of a little show, and it helped us build up to what we are now. So that Andy, thank you very much. Um, and do go out over and over and check out his net tobaccos and rest of his juices because he's got a load of juices. And he always has sales on. Just sign up to his email and you'll get uh, an email sent through that you've got 40% off. Um, there's 25% off. There's free shipping. Just go over and check them out. Sign up to the email. It's definitely worth doing. Um, definitely. Other one is um, Hip Hop Juice. Now, Hip Hop Juice has been one of my friends 
one of my supporters and has helped me out phenomenally. My first ever attempt at a logo was shit and um, I put it up on Instagram. I said, that's no, that's shit. Um, let us have a go at it and we'll send it through. So he, he did my first ever logo, um, did um, Hip Hop Juice. Um, and then since then, he's sent me juice through um, to review. He's been an avid supporter of the channel. Um, he's helped me out a few things. Um, and he's still a, a now a sponsor of the um NUVS, um, so he's on there as a sponsor. Which got a few. He gives us liquid to give away, which is absolutely brilliant. He gives us a discount code, um, which you can use Benny Ten um, to get ten percent off over at Hip Hop Juice. Um, and he's just a great guy. He, you know, he uh, could talk for England. <laughs> yeah, we get on phone. Could talk for England, but he's a brilliant guy, and he supports a lot of the smaller reviewers. Um, does hip, hip hop he's spotted a lot of people along the time that I've known him and helped him out um, and you know he, he's great so go over and show him some love um, he has some fantastic bargains on I tell you just wait for his bargains to come on and you'll see they're absolutely brilliant you know so just check out his site um, and wait for him and he'll do a price drop and suddenly it's like shit that's cheap jump on it, <laughs> I can jump on it if you see it cheap, because it'll drop it really, really low, and it'll creep back up again, just, if you see that price, that's really, really cheap, on hip hop, do definitely jump on it, um, because it'll drop them, dirt cheap, <laughs> I mean dirt cheap, so I'll keep an eye out on that, um, but thank you very much hip hop, for um, being a sponsor of the show, it means the world, and thank you very much, for all your help, throughout the two years, that I've been doing this, um, it does mean the world does that, um, which is absolutely brilliant, um, also, we've got a, a coil sponsor, which was a big shock to me. Um, he got in touch with me. I've, we have had him on the show before, um, you know, and he's one of my friends' friends that does, like I say, they do the um, bullshit, I think it's called the bullshit, so on a Saturday once a month with Jackson, and that's Sloan, um, the Cloud, Cloud Cartel UK. Um, and he just got in touch with me and said, a um, little bit of proposition to you, uh, Fancy having a coil sponsor for NUVS? And I'm like, and myself, I'm like, yeah, <laughs> thank you very much. That's much appreciated. Um, so, yeah, so Sloan did go that. We've had him on. He's going to come on once a month. He is a great guy. Um, I do like the bullshit show. So, go out and check that out. And he does some other shows. Go over and check out Cloud Cartel UK's channel. Um, and do check out his coils because um, they are really, really good. I mean, really nice little pots. Look at these. Look at these little pots you get. None of these tins. None of these plastic shit. Look at that, little bottle, little bottle with your coils in, look at that, looks really, really good that, doesn't it, little stopper on, oh, little stopper and you get coils, look at that, so yeah, so go, do check out Sloan, 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 it sounds like Sloan then, Sloan, um, and thank you very much mate for sponsoring us, thank you very much for, um, doing NUVS with us, absolutely, absolutely brilliant, man. Um, so thank you very much for uh, coming on and joining on, so yeah, so go check out his coils and get a little pot, little pot, so that's uh, that's it for um, my shows, for the people I've worked with, um, I go on to what I've um, enjoyed this year, I've enjoyed Crimson Seed 100%, I don't know if that came out last year or the beginning of this year, I don't know which, but Crimson Scene's still a banger, um, the Lemon Meringue's a banger, um, Lemon Pocket from Amatorium is really, really good, um, go check that out. Devices, devices that I've picked up that I definitely recommend getting is this Velocity, I think that's two year, a year and a half old, um, that's a banger is that, 21700, little pod thing, um, if you can pick that, I pick this up cheap off of Hip Hop Juice, um, but if you can pick that up, definitely pick it up, it's a right banging little kit, absolute banger is that one um what else have you had the i've got the drag x still to um drag x plus still to review um that's been my go-to little mod um because it's quite nice 21 700 nice in the hand um also the fat rabbit which i've got um, i got that when it first came out but everybody were jumping on it i'm still going to review it um but everybody jumped on it and I, I just didn't have time to get it out as quick as everybody else. Um, but yeah, I enjoy using that. Um, I, I use my Ab Solo um, for my mouth to lung. 
which is really good. I, I quite like it. But other people don't like it. I quite like it as a mouth to lung. I like it. it gives me everything I need because I'm not a tight mouth to lung. I'm more of a loose mouth to lung. You know, because I used to smoke cigars and they're a bit more airy than a cigarette. Um, you know, so I quite like that draw. Um, if you don't like that draw, you're not going to like it, are you? It's plain and simple. Um, but I, I quite like it. Um, what else have I had this year? Um, Blue, that's I love it. An eight it relationship from Ancient Alexa. Like it, don't like it, like it, don't like it, like it, don't like it. <laughs> it's fucking strange, tell you. So it's a love, it's like my mate, you fucking love it or hate it, and I do both, love it and hate it. Fucking strange one. Um, what else have I used this year that I've really liked? Um, a few smart things, you know, I've, I've had a few bits and pieces, some of them I still use, some of them I don't, the Arbiter I still use. Um, yeah, so few bits, few bits and pieces. I'm, I'm a bit of a creature of habit, so like I say, I'm usually. I tell you what, I did like the TTP um, pod tank. I like the flavour off of it. The fucking coils still bastard leak. The fucking things, um, cracking flavour. But fuck me, after a week, the bastard leak all over the place. Need to sort the fucking cotton out. You know, it cost me a fortune in coils. Um, so yeah, I did like it, but it's they're still fucking leaked. And the PP, the PMP um, coils, they were really, really good, but they fucking died. Um, got this fucking thing. Don't fucking bother. What a pile of shite that is. Fucking hell, I had it in an hour and I got to dry it. What a lot of bollocks. Um, so that got fucking left on my desk and <laughs> never fucking used. Um, yeah, so yeah, um, Digby's. You know, there's a couple of them from there. Um, you know, so there's a couple of the grapple, grape and apple is quite nice. Um, go check that out. Um, like I say, I'm a Torium's lemon pocket devices. And I'd much, cause, uh, like I say, it's been up and down with getting stuff in and having money and things like that, you know. So I've had to buy a little bits and pieces, you know, that I bought um, that I ain't bothered using afterwards. Being a bit of a letdown, you know. But yeah, the, I'd love to do a, a best of 2021. I don't do enough to do a best of 2021 because I don't do that much, um, don't get that much products in to compare. Um, and, you know, so there's only two couple of companies that have sent me stuff through. You know, so what am I going to just be either vapor after or smoke, wasn't it? I did enjoy the uh, GTX Go little sticks. They were they were quite nice. Um, the, uh, what did I get there? The Swag PX8 is quite good. That's quite a nice one. Quite like that. Um, the looks eighty. That was that was a nice little mod. That looks eighty. That's worth a bash. Um, like I say, the Vupu um, Drag X Plus is really good. The mod's really really nice. The tank's a bit, you know. Like I say, I did enjoy using the tank, and I would have mentioned this in the thing. But the the the, the leak the leaks like a fucking sieve after a week, which is shit. Yeah, he leak, and I mean proper fucking leaks. It's not just a. You know, if you watch my other video that I did about TPP coils, it's not just a, a little drip, it's a fucking <laughs> gusher all over your fucking hands. What a little bollocks that is. Um, so yeah, so I am, I am really, and I, I got this, I got the DJV thing, that were, um, I use that, you know, so, but that's quite old now. It's a nice mod, but it's quite old. Um, yeah, so uh, the uh, I've got that still to get the review out. That's not a bad little mod. Um scratch now right that would have been shit but uh, yeah so there has been a, a few little bits you know I still use my gross you know so there's been a few bits that I've reviewed that I still use um, but I don't have enough to do my best of 2021 I just don't have enough stuff to, to compare I can tell you what I've liked like I say I can tell you the e-liquids I've liked um, and I can tell you the devices that I'm still using but that's about it so yeah so that's, that's sort of my best of 2020, you know, companies, Vapor Esso, they have dropped me, Smock, you know, people love them or hate them. I didn't mind them, to be honest with you. I didn't mind the stuff um, from Smock. You know, some of it were all right. Some of the calls were all right. Some of them weren't, you know, but, yeah. Um, Vupu, the mods are nice. Thanks for shit. Um, Oxford, you know, they're, uh, like I say, I quite like the Arbiter, the Arbiter Solo. Um, I've got the Arbiter 2. Um, I just haven't had time to do it yet, so that's coming out in the new year. Um, so, yeah. So, I will get round. Before we wrap this up, um, I will get round to the people that I want personally 
want to want to thank um and that you know we'll start off with um a couple of new reviewers that have come through um you know you've got um jordy vapor lpc Simon 62 um quite supportive of me you know we talk um you know they've always supported the coming chat and things like that um so there you know thank you very much for a little bit of support there um much appreciated good go over and check their channels out um they are um really good um simon's got his sat the show for like three or four hours um so if you want to sit back and watch a fucking marathon go watch simon 62 you know but he, he, i will say you know I, I get on with him um i don't have a problem with him at all um so you know thank you simon um for your support um you know it's brilliant um and like i say go check out jordy's making waves coming like a coming like a wrecking ball <laughs> so go check out jordy and old uh if you can understand Wiganese, go check out uh lpc um so yeah just a couple of mentions for them they're, they're absolutely fantastic um satellite so go, go check them out um right mr jackson vape reviews not too shabby isn't not too shabby at all um does some cracking reviews from the first time i've met him um he's gone you know he's he's took off he is um a great guy go watch him um do check out the um saturday show that he does with cloud cartel with sloan um the bullshit show um jackson is a great guy he he is stepped up his game his camera works good he's you know he has really stepped it up and he's coming along he's getting up there you know i think he's got 500 subscribers now he's moving he's um you know so but he's a great guy so go check him out big love to you um jackson you know i'm always here when you want to chat mate and you know always here for you to uh if you need any tech support even though i'm a bit shit <laughs> but if you wanted some tech support <laughs> just get in touch with me um mr flat cap vapor um he's always supported me from when i first started um still comes in the shows been on his under show and he's really supportive of us he's mr flat cap vapor along with aiden little bro you know so they have been really supportive aiden love you brother you know uh, it, they're great guys uh, they took you under me took me under the wing um helped me out brought me on shows um chat to me you know and i do class them as friends that you know so it'd be good when we get to expo and we can all meet up and have a, a little bit of a, a bevy on the night um that'll be brilliant so also two other people that i would like to shout out um while we're going down a list of people that have helps me out on that like he's harley to fly future fly that's what he calls himself future fly and um mr b um also give me a shout out on their shows to get me up to a thousand harley big love um you know i love talking to you um and it does much appreciated when you all jumped off to get me off jumped on to get me over a thousand um thank you very much for mr b do check them out on three men of the vape show um the r um with on with aiden um it's a great show really really good bands on there go check them out um and you know show them some love over there but thank you very much to like i say it's three men of vape show and harley and um mr b for giving me shouts outs um on shows and um get me up to that thousand um it's much appreciated big love to you brothers big love um so yeah so thank you very much my crew from like i say nuvs um a big crew in above the clouds is one of my good friends um i do class him as a close friend ian um you know can talk to him in private we have a little bit and i get on really really well with him um which is absolutely brilliant um so go check out in above the clouds great guy and go check out uh layback vape show on a monday night with steve and josh you know and i mentioned these all before josh steve um steve blazing week in week out he comes on the nuvs never a complaint i never misses do class him as one of my close friends. He's got a dry sense of humour in the world. <laughs> you watch out for his little one-liners. He's fucking great, he's Steve. Do you know what I mean? And like I say, I've mentioned Shrek that came in and helps us out. Um, so, yeah, I mentioned, I've already mentioned Shrek came on and helped us out. So thanks very much, Shrek. Much appreciated. Been a little bit of a fuck-up year this year because um, some of my friends decided to have a bit of a fucking fallout, which is hard. It is hard. 
um, when your friends have a fallout. Um, I'm still friends with them. I'm not going to be not friends with them, but yeah, they had a fallout. And it's a bit like watching your kids fight over a fucking Xbox controller or, you know, something like that, or, you know, falling out. It just fell out. And it, it, it would be sad because we'd been friends for a while and we had a little group going on, you know, and then I'm not going to get in, ins out of it. Everybody knows my opinion on it. Um, they know what I'm what I'm on about. Um, they know my opinion. The people needed to know know my opinion, um, and other people that don't need to know my opinion don't need to know my fucking opinion. Plain and simple, you know. I don't need to tout it all the way around the fucking internet. Um, and you know, for drama, I, I've told them. You know, and that's how you do it. You go to them and you tell them. So yeah. Um, so these JP. Um, step back a little bit which is obviously reasons for that um, which is not very nice but um, he had his own reasons um, and he, he did, I tell you now he doesn't deserve the shit that he got to be fair um, we're, we're, our, we're our friends and thank you very much for being with me for the last two years and being my friend uh, it means the world so also on the new yes, um to thank is Jay Hooked on Funk um, he is a really good friend. I talk to him all. We talk to him all the time. We are really good friends. Um, all my NUVS lads are really good friends of mine. Um, everybody that's been on are still class as friends. Jay is absolutely brilliant. Um, what a great guy. Um, I can't forget, while we're on with Jay, that we also do a little radio shows um, together, which is which I forgot to mention at the beginning. Um, we do the 510 radio. Um, with Jay's idea put it out there, did it on his own, and then put, we've just sort of gravitated around him because he's that sort of guy, and he gives us a little spot on his radio show, which is mine's Monday night at 11 o'clock. Um, so Jay Oaks on phone, what, like I say, he will do anything for you. Um, he is a great guy. Um, go check him out on his radio show. Go check out the 510. Give him a little bit of support. Um, but Jay, you are. Big love to your brother. Thank you very much for your support. Um, from when we first met, which is same again, two years ago. Um, thank you very much for your support. Thank you very much for doing NUVS with us. It does mean a lot. Um, it really does. And the last person to thank is um, Mr. Big D Vapes. Um, like I said to you earlier on, Danny is one of my best friends. Um, we talk a lot. Um, he does support the channel by letting me have stuff. Um, I tell him not to, he still fucking does it. Um, he still gives himself to review, um, you know, e liquids and things like that. So, you know, he, he's a great guy. Um, he will do all for you. Um, bit of a stubborn fucker, but he, he, will, he will do stuff for you. Um, do you know what I mean? And he, he's a great, great friend of mine. Um, so, thank you very much, Danny. Um, from the first time I met you to, to now, we have been really good friends, um, which is just over two years now. Um, that we've known each other. So some other people that I need to shout out is Mick and Bill from the Late Night Vape Show. Um, do go check them out. They're on after NUVS. They are fantastic people. Um, I talked to Mick and Bill, I talked to Bill because obviously he's on uh, the uh, E-Liquid Mixing Show with us, you know, and he's a really good friend. Um, Mick, I talked to quite a lot. Um, he, he's a really good friend. Um, really, really good friends, uh, Mick and Bill, and also uh, Graham Net, Real Net Reality. Graham's that's another person. That, you know, you so many people. Graham is one of one of my really good friends as well. Not only does he does the e liquid mixing show, but he comes in. We have a little bit of a, a chat going on after shows. Um, you know, so we do go in each other's chat afterwards, and we talk. And we talk for hours. They're, they're really good friends uh, of mine, uh, Mick, Bill, and Graham. Um, absolutely fantastic people um, just uh, salt to the earth we could chat about anything I, I class them as one of my really good friends um, you know so you need a chat we jump in with them they're, they're, they're great Mick and Bill and Graham absolutely really good friends um, of mine of them um, you know so thank you for your support um, for the last two years Um Mick Bill Graham um, means a lot, and Disco when she's in, um, we we could chat for hours. Honestly, they're, they're really, really, really good friends. I can't, you know. So go check them out. Go check out the shows. So big love. So big love to all my NUVS lads, all my friends that I've made in the vaping scene. 
Um, big love to you all. If I have missed you out, I'm really, really sorry. Um, I didn't mean to, but thank you very much. Big love to you all, and uh, thank you very much. And the last people I need to thank is you lot. All of you. All of you out there who watch my videos, watch the shows that we do week in, week out. Thank you very much to you. It means the world that you give us all your support. It means the world that you've took your time out of your day to watch my videos, comment on the videos, watch the shows. It's absolutely brilliant. For the people that I've met in Zoom and things like that, you know who you are. Thank you very much um, for your support and love you all. Um, much appreciated. Um, so, yeah, so thank you very much for all the support. Um, thank you very much for stopping with me over the two years. For the new people and the old people, thank you very much. It's much appreciated. Onwards and upwards. I'm not going to say I'm round and going for the EC Click Awards or all like that. Because it's not going to fucking happen. Um, they're all done deals. You, you've got to be really, really popular to get into these things. I did put a little bit of a thing out, but we got fucking nowhere. You know, so there's no point saying, I'm coming for you. I'm going to be up on there. I'm going to show it. No point. Because unless you've got fucking a load of things on Facebook, unless you've got all sorts of social media and you've got a big following, you'll get fucking nowhere. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. But yeah, I'm not going to say it. If there is an expo next year, do look out for me. Come over. Show me some love. Um, probably can't hug you, but I can uh, give you a little smile. Give you a little big penny love. So yeah, come over and see us. Um, so, but thank you very much for all your support throughout the year. Thank you very much for getting us over a thousand subscribers. It does mean the world to me. Um, so yeah, so thank you very much. So right, I'm going to sign this off. Thank you very much um, for sticking with me. Like I said, thank you very much for your support. Thank you very much for coming on this journey with me. It does mean the world to me. Um, hope you have a fantastic new year. Do wish you all the best um for the new year um we'll catch you the other side and we'll see where we go but big love to you thank you very much for supporting me it means the world and happy new year to you and your family bye